Hey guys, Zach Uack here, back with another video. In today's video, I will be teaching you all about Roblox Studio's terrain editor and how to use it. So let's get right into it. First of all, where do you find the terrain editor? Here, you click View, and then over here, you select Terrain Editor. This window will pop up. So what does this do? Basically, using this tool, you can create really cool maps and really cool land for your game. Let's try it out. So the first tool we're gonna be going over is the generate tool. When you click it, you get this big box and you can put it wherever you want and you can scale it to however big you want it to be. Let's say you want your terrain to be this big. Now you can scroll down to material settings and you can select what materials you want to be inside this box. For this, I'm just gonna do water, plains, mountains, and hills. Okay, now we can click generate and it automatically generates a terrain for us. Now let's try generating another one. Let's hit clear. Let's add dunes, marsh, and also let's make this taller. There you go. As you can see, it generated another terrain for us with a little lava pool here and some grass here. Now for the next part, let's go over here and click edit. Here, let's click select, and now you can make another box with terrain. You can also use transform to rotate it. And now we can hit fill, go down, and we can change what material is gonna be here. Let's do grass. Let's hit apply, and there you go. We have our terrain. You can also replace your terrain with something else. For example, brick right here. Now, this terrain is pretty plain. So what we can do is we can click draw and using this, we can add terrain onto our block. You can change the color of our brush. I'm probably gonna do circle. You can change the base size to make it bigger. I'll keep it at six. You can change the pivot position, but I'll keep that at center. Now, let's say you want to add a hill onto your block of grass. We're gonna go over here and we're gonna select a material like maybe ground. Now we can draw our hill here, and there you go. We have a little hill. Now let's try the sculpt button. Now the sculpt button basically erodes the ground from where you click it. Now I'm going to try the smoothen tool, and I can smoothen my hill with it to make it look more round. This seems pretty nice. Now the flatten tool is pretty straightforward. You drag this grid over to where you want it to be flat right here and then you hold and it'll be perfectly flat. And the last part we're gonna go over is paint. Let's say you want your hill to have lava coming out of it. We can select cracked lava and we can paint our terrain like this. I think this is a little too big so I'm going to change the size to three and we're gonna make some lava flow out of here. And in the bottom, we can do a lava pool. All right, so now that we know the basics of our terrain editor, let's try making a cool terrain. Okay guys, that's it for today's video. I hope you learned something new and now you should be well on your way to mastering the terrain editor in Roblox Studio.